there's three things that you can do that will ruin your dog's performance in the long term. The number one thing, worst thing that you could do is have the dog look at you. When you just get the dog, you just get the puppy, you have a dog look at you. Why you wanna do that? Your dog needs to extract energy from something else, not you, it's never been about you, it's not about your face, your eyes, it's about what that dog wants and let that dog be attracted to that source, what he really loves, and then later on, you could extract that energy and do something useful with it, okay? So don't just have the dog look at you. The second one is loading a marker. Now think about it. If you're gonna mark something, that means you wanna communicate with the dog, but you wanna communicate about what? If you haven't even taught this dog anything significantly, like showing something at least that is worth mentioning. And you can't because the dog doesn't know anything, so why should you even bother loading a marker? Really, think about it. Number three, having a dog stay in position. Now what the hell is that? You have a dog stay in position just because he offers that position and he wants to stay in that? What you're actually doing now is you're rewarding passive behavior. But you want action, you want dynamics, you want speed, you want all that. So what you do not want to do then is just reward your dog in that same position the whole time. So if you're looking to ruin your performance, become mediocre, do those three.